Good morning everyone, Wednesday morning, day one of isolating and day one really to unveil the eyebrows. So I've not got a scrap of makeup on as yet, um, but just so you can have a close up look. Those. Okay. Um, little bit puffy at the minute which is to be expected and I'm putting an ointment on each morning for the next 14 days um, but for stage one I think they're pretty impressive uh, when I go back for the top up in four weeks time then Abby will fill a little bit more in where I haven't got the hairs. Where it looks a bit darker, that's because I have got some hair there. Um, but she said it will even out over the next uh, couple of weeks. But when I go back, I can then decide if I want to change the colour at all or whatever. Um, but yeah... It was okay. Was it painful? No, not really. To me, it was just like being scratched with a pin. And uh, I certainly wasn't uncomfortable. And um, even last night, you know, she said, because she said you may get tightness. Okay, it, it was a little bit tight, but nothing that I couldn't cope with. So, I mean, for me, Personally, now I've got eyebrows and that was the aim uh, and the end result that I was looking for. So, um, right, what am I going to do on my first day on my lonesome, apart from Archie, obviously? Um, first of all, as I say, I haven't got any makeup on, but I am going to put some face on. I'm not going to put anything on my eyes um, because I'm not going anywhere, but we won't let the standards slip completely. So, um, I've, I've done my cleansing. Obviously, I haven't got to get these wet at all, so I've been very careful with the cleansing this morning. And um, I'm going to put just a little of the skin truffle just to make me look alive rather than dead <laughs> so it's just nice to go on there and then with the forehead, I'm going to be very careful that I don't go anywhere near the eyes. The other thing <laughs> is that I can't wash my hair either, so um, it isn't looking its best, but uh, it'll, it'll be all right. So that's that. Um, and then I'll just put a tiny bit of de-stress, just a little, so a tiny little bit of de-stress, just to even out and give me that bit of a glow. bit on the forehead because I'm trying to keep my hair away from my eyebrows as well so I better put a little bit of uh, camouflage up the top and that's it really I haven't put in anything else on as a base so that's that I'm going to put a little bit of um, BFFI Victoria just under my eyes 
just so that it looks as if I'm a bit more well awake. I didn't have a bad night's sleep, um, but I was conscious to not put my hands anywhere near my face. Uh, and the more you think about it, the more you, you feel you want to do it. <laughs> so, and yeah. Let's just get a bit of a wake up there. Okay. And I'll put a little bit of wakes just to put a bit of colour in my cheeks. Is that enough? Oh, I think so. There and there. And let's think. What's that one? Oh, found Sue's line on the top, so we'll just have a little slick of Sue's on the lips. And I think that, that will do me for today. As I say, nobody's really going to be seeing me, um, apart from when I FaceTime later. But uh, I look a bit more awake than I did before. So, um, <laughs> you all seem to enjoy our weekend walk and now testing the pleather yesterday so um it, it was great fun doing it <laughs> it really was and uh, there'll be be another um little surprise for you by the end of the week so let's just say that um what am i going to fill my time with today well of all things, it's bright sunshine <laughs> and um, I've got a lot of leaf leaves on the drive, uh, sort of fallen on the drive. I will point out they're not from my tree, they're from the neighbour's tree. And I think your neighbours should come and sweep them up, but you know, there we go. So I'm going to pick all the leaves up and tied around on the back a bit and I think it's given out rain for this afternoon so I'd probably catch up with some of the Friday friends filming um, obviously we we get the the guest to let us have their little clip and then I do the intro and my bit and then it gets sent off to Heather for her to do the end bit and the close. So we've got a few in the, well, as I say, we've, we've got quite a few in the pipeline that we need to top and tail, so to speak. So um, it gives me the opportunity to do some of those. Okay. What am I wearing? Um, well, I could have stayed in my dressing gown, but that's not me. Um, so I've just put a pair of leggings on and uh, this jumper, I was trying to think back and um, it was from Wallace and I had it before the end of my marriage. So it's over 13 years old, um, but it's one of those fluffy jumpers. Look nice, nice. And if I can't have any cuddles anywhere, then I can cuddle myself. <laughs> so, um, so it's that and, uh, as I say, just a pair of black leggings, just so that I can go outside and do some bits and pieces. Um, and, and I think that's it. You know, it's just a quick catch up each day and uh, keep in touch with everybody. Um, 
I'm not looking forward to the two weeks sort of isolating and, and apologies to all those that don't have a choice and they've been self-isolating for what would seem like yonks and yonks um, and I, I won't take anything away from them um, but when you've been released out into the world and then you suddenly can't do and especially when you've you know had a little change of direction in your life um, with my gentleman friend uh, then two weeks is going to feel like an awfully long time but um, at the end of it obviously I'll be getting one of the eyes done so we're just we're just together me and you uh, we'll just take each day as it comes so have a great one everybody and uh, I'll catch up with you tomorrow bye